Hey everyone, I went to MAC a couple days ago and I picked up a bunch of things from the New Style Black collection and a few things from the Fall Winter Trends 09 collection and I was just super excited about this. It was my birthday a couple weeks ago so I put some money aside because I knew I was going to get almost everything from the Style Black collection and I pretty much did. So, um, the first two things I'm going to talk about are the Volcanic Ash Exfoliator and the Thermal Mask. And let me tell you, if you are not interested in this collection because it's black or whatever, you should still definitely check these two things out because they are absolutely amazing. I used the Exfoliator last night and, actually I used both of them last night, and my skin looked really amazing today the exfoliator it feels a little bit um harsh at first but it just it melts away and it left my skin glowing and clean and just the perfect perfect setup to use the mask and the thermal mask it feels a little bit like the Biore mask I'm not sure what it's called if it's thermal mask or heat activated something like that but when you put it on and you start to like rub it in a little bit you could feel the heat and then you leave it on for about five minutes and then you wash it off and my skin glowed I just absolutely love these two things I bought two of the um, exfoliators and I only was able to get one of the mask because they already sold out so I think Thursday when the collection officially launches I'll probably pick up another mask and maybe a third exfoliator I don't know we'll see but definitely definitely check these two things out and uh, I got all four of the mineralized eyeshadows and I'm usually not a fan of the eyeshadows of those mineralized eyeshadows because I find them to be like glittery glittery and they have a lot of fallout but these aren't really glittery they're more shimmery there's some fallout but it's not a horrendous amount so um let's see the first one I have is Cinderfella and it's more of a silver kind of color and that one's this top one right here actually what I did was on top I applied them dry and then on underneath them I applied them with a bit of fix plus so you could see the difference they are very pigmented and I love the way they look dry but they have an, a really nice effect when you apply them with the, uh, with a little bit of moisture so I just wanted to show you both of that both of those so let's see first one is cinder fella and that is I cannot see this top one right here and if you can see it's like a gray like a darkened gray color and underneath it right here is how it looks applied with some fix plus and it just gives it a beautiful I would say more of a like gunmetal color very nice and the second one is blue flame and it is this beautiful blue dark blue color and that one is where is it it is right here and dry it applies with like a I would say like a charcoal gray base with blue sparkles but then look at the difference of how it applies when you apply it with a bit of moisture to it. It really, really brings out the, the vibrant blue color. It is just gorgeous, gorgeous, gorgeous. And the next one is Young Punk. And that is this beautiful purple. And that one is... right here and it's the same kind of deal as the blue flame that it, they all seem to have the same like 
black and gray base and then it has purple sparkles but then when you apply it with the fix plus it just look at that it's just beautiful beautiful deep purple color I think you can see it better now yeah and right next to it right up here is guilt by association and it is the gold it's like a black and gold and this was the color I was the least excited about but unexpectedly it's probably my favorite of the four and let's see where is it okay that's how it applies dry and then when you apply it wet it is just a gorgeous gorgeous gold color really really nice I, I can't explain it but it's just gorgeous and let's see on to the lipsticks the first lipstick is called black night and it is a black lipstick it is a cream sheen and that one is where is it yeah it's this one right here and it took a few swipes for it to become that dark so you know don't be afraid of it because it's black because you could use it you can use the, the lipstick to darken a lipstick that might be too light or dull down a lipstick that's too bright so it's definitely an interesting oh I got a hair in it it's definitely an interesting color and uh, the next one is the Mateen lipstick in Midnight Media and it is black and that one is right here and it applied very opaque and matte which I love I actually like this one better than the lipstick one only because I wanted a true black lipstick and I, I like the way it looks better than the other one I tried all of these lipsticks on and I love the way all of them look the only thing is the reason why I didn't put it on on camera is because I'm self-conscious about the braces so six days from now the braces will be off and I'll be able to put on everything that I got and I'm super excited about it because I love love dark colors so yeah and the next lipstick is night violet oh and it looks like this it is a beautiful purple wine color and that's that one right there gorgeous gorgeous wine color I cannot wait to wear it and they have